Welcome back to Madden 20. Today we have one of the best rivalries in the past few years. It is the Baltimore Ravens and the Kansas City Chiefs, both teams leaving the tunnel today. We have the 2019 unanimous MVP Lamar Jackson going against the 2018 MVP Patrick Mahomes. So let's take a look at the next gen stats in this game as we're going through the opening sequence here. Last year, Lamar Jackson, the top QBR, passing 100.1, short passing 85.4. He completed short passes 78% of the time. As here in Baltimore for the second straight year, this rivalry dominated by Kansas City. Mahomes is 3-0 against Lamar Jackson in his career. Lamar looking to finally get win number one against one of the best teams in the league, and there's Patrick Mahomes. The last game in 2020 dominated as you can see the comparison there. 38 touchdowns to 11 picks for Mahomes, 26 and 9 for Lamar. Scramble percentage though for Lamar Jackson, 24% of the time. Both these coaches looking for number two, ring number two I should say is Kansas City has won the coin toss and has deferred. So from Baltimore, m and Bank Stadium, Back deep for the Ravens as we'll get things ready. Back deep for the Ravens is going to be Devin Duvernay, the second-year wide receiver. This is John Harbaugh and Andy Reid. Ten-minute quarters again. Today we're going to be doing a longer video as Bucker teases up. It's going to be the full game, and in the future we're just going to be doing highlights. This is going to be an exhibition mode, so we can see the differences in each mode as Duvernay awaits the kick. So we'll be seeing every play today, including kickoffs. And here we go. DuVernay from the eight. We'll take it across the 20, and not by much. He's tackled pretty much immediately. And out comes the 2019 unanimous MVP. We probably underrated that season, how great it was. The passing stats aren't great. He missed a few games to COVID in 2020. 26 touchdowns to nine picks. He's one of the best in the league in he proves and finally has some weapons around him with Sammy Watkins and Rashad Bateman. This will start from the 21-yard line. And Jackson will throw a quick pass. It's caught by Andrews, and he's got five. And we got an injury early on. It's Frank Clark. I remember there being any injuries in the uh, Buccaneer game last time. So we'll see the sequence. And he's on the sideline. Usually in previous Maddens, that means he's going to come back in the game. So second down and five from the 25. Jackson in the pistol, they give it. Watkins in motion, he gets the tap pass. Tackled in the backfield by Taco Charlton. That gives him a third down and six. They need the 31 yard line. J.K. Dobbins is the running back. Jackson will throw quickly over the middle. Caught by Marquise Brown who changed to number five in the off season. It's a first down. So three th straight throws for Lamar starting the game. They got a first down as the first handoff of the game goes to J.K. Dobbins, and it's a game of five. Ever since Lamar Jackson took over, it has consistently been one of the best rushing attacks in the NFL. The second and five, Jackson will throw on the move. He is dropped. Chris Jones gets Lamar Jackson to loss of seven. It's third down and long. Or Jackson had a good pocket. I don't know why he scrambled. You can see there he just started to go feel someone in the middle. Chris Jones just demolished Andrew Vill Villanueva. And that's a third down and long now. They need the 45. Jackson the throw. Sets up the screen. It's J.K. Dobbins and tackled at the 40. It's a gain of seven. And they'll have to punt. And Kansas City will be getting the ball for again. Well, for the first time today. But Cole Hardman, the deep man, will let this ball bounce at the two and into the end zone, and out comes 2018 MVP Patrick Mahomes. Incredible season. Last year, 4,700 yards and 38 touchdowns. The best quarterback in the NFL, and has consistently proved to be that ever since he started playing in 2018. As the Chiefs will start at the 20-yard line. 
Mahomes will go under center. And he'll throw. Five-man rush. Mahomes, pressure. They're going to roll. Gets set. Pulls out on the ground. It's picked up by Baltimore. Picked up by Wolf. He's tackled at the 12. And Mahomes on the first play turns it over. The pressure up the middle. Mahomes had to feel it and escape. Tyus Bowser got him on contain. What a rush to get him. It forces the ball out. It's a loose ball. And out comes Lamar again. The short field. They start at the 12. The team has been one of the best in the red zone. But that rushing attack, it's hard not to be as Lamar will throw. And over the middle. That's Mark Andrews down to the two. He couldn't quite get in the end zone, but now first and goal. From the pistol. The handoff. Dobbins, and he's stuffed by Chris Jones. Nowhere to go. It's second and goal. Jackson with a rare trip under center. Goal line personnel. Gus Edwards is the running back. He gets it. Up the middle. Touchdown, Baltimore. Gus Edwards, two yards now, and the Ravens cash in it after the Mahomes fumble. So that was pretty easy. How about that run defense was a problem for Kansas City pretty much the entire time Mahomes has started. And this was easy for Gus Edwards, just fights in. Patrick Ricard, the leading fullback, didn't even have to block anyone. Gerard Reed there couldn't tackle Edwards. So the extra point by Justin Tucker automatic is always three plays, 11 yards, 117 off the clock. Gus Edwards gets the Ravens on the board, our first score of the game here in Baltimore. And we've gone through about half of the first quarter. So as Justin Tucker tees up, Miko Hardman is the deep man who will return kick and punting duties. We saw that when Sam Cook punted earlier as Tucker sends us away. And Ardman will watch that go over the back of the end zone, and out comes Mahomes again. One play, one turnover. Mahomes fumbled. It was the first snap of offense for the Chiefs. Looking to not do that again. And this will start from the 25. Mahomes with a blitz underneath. Incomplete for Clyde Edwards Elair, the first round running back out of LSU from 2019. The second and 10. The screen pass, Edward Hilaire tackled in the backfield by Brandon Williams. And now momentum's shifting in Baltimore's favor. It's third down and 14. That was a loss of four. They need the 35 yard line. Mahomes, unblocked defender. He gets Edward Hilaire across the 30. Can he get there? He's about two yards short. It's again a 12. And three straight plays targeting Edwards Eaton here. They can't get a first down three and out for Kansas City. This Townsend will send it. James Proche calls a fair catch at the 26-yard line. And Baltimore has a chance to get a two-score lead over the Chiefs. Now, of course, a two-score lead over the Chiefs is pretty much nothing. They can score seven straight touchdowns if they'd like. Yeah, this will start at the 26. The handoff, Dobbins shoves off Hitchens and has a... Good gain on first down, and they give him seven. They love to stay in the pistol. Second and three. As the handoff, Dobbins checkled in the backfield. Ball's thrown on the ground, but they're going to say he was down. So third down and three. They need the 36-yard line. Jackson will throw another screen. J.K. Dobbins tackled in the backfield by Willie Gay. Six straight completions for Lamar, and three and out Baltimore. So Sam Cook again, opponent to uh, McCole Hartman, all the way back at the 12. Great punt, tackled. McCole is at the 17, and the Chiefs take back over. So a fumble and a punt will start the game for the Chiefs. Not an ideal of first two drives, is with two minutes to play. Hill goes in motion, he gets the tap pass. Uh, blocked by Kelsey, Tyreek makes a move, and there he goes up the sideline, breaks free. Tyreek Hill, goodbye. Oh, blur, 83 yards, touchdown, Kansas City. Game breaking speed, Kelsey's the first one to greet him, and Tyreek Hill takes over its tie ball game, just like that. Let's take a look at next-gen stats. All of that was after the catch. They'll give him 86.2 yards after the catch on this 
tap pass by Mahomes. Tyreek Hill, <laughs> playing like he has for the past three years, and the Chiefs in one play. That's what we were talking about. Why multi-score leads are nothing to this team is they can just rip off an 83-yard touchdown like that. One play, 83 yards, 12 seconds off the clock. Tyree Kill ties this game. As Bucker will send it. Duvernay from the 8-yard line once again across the 25. To the 26 he goes. He's tackled. And Lamar Jackson will take the field once again. Full house backfield on first down and 10 from the 26. Patrick Ricard goes in motion. And Lamar will keep it. Jackson turning upfield. Ball's on the ground again. It's the second fumble of the game by the quarterback. Picked up by Etchins. And we'll see if Jackson was on the ground. Usually with quarterbacks, it really is a fumble. As we'll see who forced it. Looked like number 44, uh, Dorian O'Daniel. And looks like Jackson was on the ground, so they will review it. And they will overturn it. So that, the Chiefs keep their momentum boost after that fumble. A second and six. Dorian Daniel gets Jackson in the backfield, and it's a loss of two. Leaves him with a third down and eight. Final minute of the opening quarter. They need the 36-yard line once again. Jackson protected. Going to go for it. Marquise Brown is dropped. The first incompletion of the game for Lamar Jackson. Three and out Baltimore. So the Chiefs will take back over as the punt by Cook. McCole Hardman, another great punt all the way at the 16, the 14, I should say. And Hardman doesn't even make it to the 20. Well, he'll actually barely make it to the 20. It looked like he was tackled with 19. That's where the Kansas City Chiefs will start last drive. Of course, the 83-yard touchdown in one play as the throw to Hill, first down at the 30. And Patrick Mahomes already over 100 yards passing. As well, this will be the final play of the quarter. And the screen pass. Edward Zelayer gets a block. Clyde tackled by Marcus Peters. And that will do it for the first quarter. Kansas City tied this game in one play. It's 7-7 here in Baltimore. As you can see the offensive and defensive snaps out. No why the tap passes. They're technically pass plays, but they're counted as rush plays in that. As second down and five of the second quarter begins. And City has the ball from the 35-yard line. Blitz is sent, picked up, and caught. Demarcus Robinson uh, over Marlon Humphrey. That's only a gain of one, though. Third down and four. They need the 31-yard line. Mahomes will throw. Only a four-man rush. Caught. Demarcus Robinson again. Two straight completions, Sam. The Chiefs move the chains. So first and 10 from the 45. Mahomes with the blitz. And the throw to Hardman. Breaks, gets a catch, and breaks free. McCall Hardman makes one miss, and there it goes. Touchdown. Another one with game breaking speed. 55 yards. Touchdown, Chiefs. Now let's take a look at the next gen stats. Let's look at the top speed as Marcus Peters almost jumped that. But McCall Hardman just secured the catch and reached over 22 miles an hour on that breakaway. And that's an easy 55 for Kansas City. And they've taken the lead. So Harrison Bucker to give the Chiefs a 7-point lead. The momentum fully in their favor. The kick is up and good. 5 plays, 81 yards, a minute 44. Kansas City as quick at scoring as ever. Let's see if Jackson can tie the game again. As Duvernay from 4 yards deep will take a knee. And now comes... Jackson again, can he do something? Their only scoring drive was an 11-yard touchdown drive after a Mahomes fumble as Dobbins up the middle, he's got two. The running game's not going as well as you'd hope as second down and eight. Uh, Sammy Watkins, the former Chief, goes in motion. He gets the tap pass. Same direction as it's Tyreek Hill touchdown, but this one doesn't have the same effect. They only have gained a two, a third down and six. They need the 35. Taking the play clock down to the 8. Jackson, quick throw open is Watkins down to the 44-yard line. And the Ravens 
on the move again. They needed that first down bad. So from the 44, Lamar in the pistol. He'll keep it on the option. Lamar Jackson up the sideline, and there he goes. Another big play. Touchdown, Ravens. 56 yards. Lamar Jackson's showing the speed, and we got three of the fastest players in the NFL playing today. We've had touchdowns of 83, 55, and now 56. This is a tie ball game. Tyra Matthew takes a bad angle, and Lamar Jackson, if you take a bad angle against him, it's just game over. You give him the edge. He can outrun everybody. And there is a great drive by the former MVP. This game is tied after Justin Tucker will kick this extra point. Of course, this is Madden. And until I'm proven otherwise, these will be automatic. As four plays, 75 yards, 2-0-1 off the clock. Here's your scoring drive. Baltimore, a much-needed score to get momentum back. As Tucker will kick it, McCole Hardman from the two. I'll take it across the 20 and 25 and to the 26 or 7 yard line. On, As the Chiefs take over, two straight touchdown drives. Their first four drives go fumble, punt, touchdown, touchdown. Is under center from Mahomes. And the fake. And give it. Oh, what a stiff arm by Edward T. Lair. Fighting off another. He's got nine. Unbelievable effort. And that's how second down and one. They didn't get the first down. And that was their first rush of the game. Handoff, Edwards E. Lair. And nowhere to go. It's going to be third down. He didn't get the first down. So three tight ends set for the Chiefs. They need to push the ball forward a bit. Just a few inches as the handoff. Edwards E. Lair. He's going to get it. First down, Kansas City. And that was needed. So the Chiefs keep the drive alive. Their first three rushing plays go for a total of 12 yards. And a first down. Mahomes will go back up top, though. On the run. Throws it away. Nothing open. That's only the third combined incompletion by either quarterback today. Only been automatic. Uh, second to 10, the play fake to Edward D. Lair. Mahomes stands in. Throws. Caught. Number 83, Gray. And only the Chiefs will make... Someone I've never heard of get a 19-yard gain. As we're under four minutes to play now in the second quarter. Mahomes will throw a quick pass. Travis Kelsey. He's got a good gain of seven or six. Second down. Tyreek Hill and Travis Kelsey together at the top of the screen on second and four. The handoff, Edward D. Lair. Nowhere to go. Kansas City run game has been effective. It never really has been. They've always had to rely on Patrick Mahomes' arm. And it's third down and four. Steps up through the rush. Mahomes keeps it himself. First down. Slides at the 30-yard line. They've had to rely on Patrick Mahomes' arm. Now he relies on his legs. It's been working really well for Kansas City as the handoff. Edwards Elair takes us to the two-minute warning with a zero-yard rush. So two minutes to play. Kansas City in scoring range. This game's tied 14-14. Uh, 30 yards away from three straight touchdown drives. As Mahomes will be alone in the backfield. Tyreek Hill at the bottom, at the top of the screen there in the slot. Quick pass to him on the outside. Caught again to 15, and they're in the red zone once again. Well, for the first time today, I should say. All their touchdowns have been long as first down and 10 from the 15. Blitz sent, quick pass. Travis Kelsey gets the block by Hill. Out of bounds at the three. It's goal to go, Kansas City. How about that play? Getting Travis Kelsey and having Tyree Hill block for him. So first and goal from the three-yard line. Mahomes alone in the backfield. No throw. Quick pass, wide open. Kelsey, touchdown. Three straight touchdown drives. Travis Kelsey caps it off, and the Chiefs back in front. So how about that drive by Kansas City driving down the field, taking time off the clock, so Baltimore has to throw now, and they send a blitz, and someone, either Deshaun Elliott or LJ Fort, just doesn't match Travis Kelsey, and it's easy. They'll kick the extra point now. They're up seven. It's going to be 21-14. 
Here's Bunker. The hold. And it's good. 12 plays, 73 yards. 5.06 off the clock. That's more than half the quarter. So Bunker sends it. And Devin Duvernay will watch that go out of the back of the end zone. So out comes the Ravens. Can they do something before half? They got Sammy Watkins and Rashad Bateman for this exact reason. It was from the 25 they'll start. Jackson will throw. Here comes the rush on the outside, Marquise Brown. Brown down to the 37 yard line. They'll go in hurry up mode. So about a minute left, Jackson will throw. And on the outside, there's Marquise Brown again to midfield. And Baltimore takes their first time out. They've been really balanced today, nine rushes to 11 passes. We're making this a little more unbalanced though as the quarter ends. As the check down to J.K. Dobbins out of bounds with a gain of five. Again, Lamar Jackson has one incompletion. Patrick Mahomes has two. It's been a clean game by both quarterbacks. It's protection, great, and downfield. It's caught by Sammy Watkins and another timeout by Baltimore. What a... Th Great pass protection for Baltimore. As they're in longest, well, they're in scoring range now from the 27. Jackson. Here comes Jones again. He's dropped. Chris Jones in the backfield again. The same problem as his first sack. It's the third sack of the game by both teams. It's second and 21. You can see here, Lamar just runs. I mean, the protection didn't really hold up. He had to go somewhere, but Chris Jones with perfect contain. We're under 15 seconds now. Jackson will throw. And throws it to Brown. Can't get out of bounds. They'll take their final timeout. And the Ravens will kick a field goal. They won't risk it. One play. And Tucker drills it. It's 21-17. Heading into halftime. I'll spare you the few plays as we head into the locker room. Here's the first half stats. The Chiefs. Moving the ball at will. Three straight touchdown drives to the end of the half. And here's the halftime remote. Let's look at next-gen stats. The Kansas City Chiefs threw short almost half the time. Completed every pass for 22 air yards. Of course, we're probably considering the tap pass as a short pass. For the Ravens, they ran inside about 40% of the time. They had 77 rushing yards. Surely that includes the touchdown by Lamar. That's 7.6 yards per carry. There's your halftime stats powered by Next Gen Stats. Kansas City won the coin toss at the top of the game. So they'll be getting the football first here as Justin Tucker gets us ready to kick off the second half action. Kansas City looking to dominate once again. As this game has just been insane. Is There's Mahomes practicing, there's Tyree Kill. Of course, Tyreek Hill had the 83-yard touchdown to get the Chiefs on the board. And how about the drives by the Ravens? They had a punt, the touchdown on the short field, another punt, a touchdown, and then a field goal. Kansas City just doing their best. Miko Hardman back deep again. Let's see if he can get a good return going. Tucker sends us away into the wind. McCole Hardman from the seventh. Across the 20, 25 to the 27 yard line. And let's take a look at some highlights for Patrick Mahomes and this Kansas City offense. Just big plays as always. How about McCall Hartman, 55 yards. That was almost great by Marcus Peters to jump that, but one missed tackle and there you go, 22 miles an hour later. And then the touchdown before half to put the Kansas City Chiefs up four heading into the locker rooms. Travis Kelsey left all alone, and Chiefs will start at the 27. They have 230 yards of offense to Baltimore's 159. Mahomes in the gun. He'll throw. Steps up on the pocket. Throws. It's caught. McCall Hartman. It guns it to him, and all the way to the 48-yard line on the first play. So from the 48-yard line, near midfield already. First and ten. Mahomes alone in the backfield. He'll throw. Protected. Going to gun it to Robinson. He's got separation down to the 15-yard line. And he's down to the 14. And at two quick plays, they're already in the red zone. How about that? Mahomes is in the zone. First and ten from the 14. 
And they'll hand it. Edwards Elair. He's got about three. So second down and seven. Trying to extend the lead, make it four straight touchdown drives. And the handoff. Edwards Elair. Nowhere to go. Mahomes has three touchdowns today in this game. They need the four yard line to convert. Third down and seven. Mahomes steps up, throws on the move. Tyree Kill, first down and goal. They're at the two. And the Chiefs punch it in. Three tight end set. Edwards Elair, the running back. Mahomes, the handoff. Edwards Elair tackled in the backfield, and he won't get there. The loss of two. Second and goal. Edwards Elair still in there. He's played pretty much all game. The pass, Edwards Elair tackled by Patrick Queen. Third and goal. The touchdown here will put Mahomes at exactly 300 yards passing. He'll throw. Mahomes, Hill, touchdown! It's easy. Mahomes has number four, and the Chiefs have scored four in a row. Tyreek Hill, you send the five-man rush. They have to play man coverage behind it. And Marlon Humphrey just doesn't have the speed to keep up with Tyreek Hill, unfortunately, underneath. Don't give any extra help for Hill. And it's easy. 28-17 after Bucker drills this extra point. Eight plays, 73 yards, four minutes off the clock. It took them two plays to get in the red zone, and it still was a four-minute drive. That was just incredible by them. As the kick into the end zone, Duvernay takes a knee. Seven yards deep, and now comes the Ravens for their first drive in the half. They got it going at the end of the half, too. A long touchdown, and then the drive to get the field goal. As the fake to Dobbins. Jackson on the move, sets his feet again, now Garunin. He's got a lot of speed across the 40s, slides to 44. Lily Gay was the spy on that play, he couldn't hold up. And a big first down for Baltimore. From the 44 yard line, Jackson with a blitz. He'll step up and throw, open is Brown, tackled by Tyron Matthew, and down to the 38 yard line, they're already in scoring range. Well, at least long distance scoring range for Tucker. So from the 38, first down and 10. Jackson, four man rush. Will step up and miss his receiver. And they'll get momentum back in Kansas City favor. Second and 10. And the handoff to Dobbins. He's not going to get anywhere. He's only averaging two yards a carry. It's third down and 11. From here, it will be a 58-yard field goal. As Jackson will throw and go nearly picked off by Ward, intended for Brown. This is third incompletion of the game. And out comes Justin Tucker. It'll actually be 56 yards from here. And the kick is up. And it is no good. Wide left, and the Chiefs get the ball in great scoring position. They'll start at the 46. So here's Mahomes. Five-man rush over the middle. Hit. It's Travis Kelsey down to the 37. A game of 16. Mahomes over 300. Already in the third quarter. It's from the 37. Mahomes, blitz, he's dropped. Patrick Queen was unblocked. And it's a loss of eight. Oh, that was a big play for Baltimore. That takes him out of field goal range. Is, uh, Patrick Queen, you, you don't want inexperienced offensive linemen when you play against Baltimore. And Patrick Queen was just missed in that blitz pickup. Second on an 18 now. Mahomes will run. And check it down. Edwards Elair has a lot of space, but he can't turn up field. And third down and 13 for the Chiefs. Third down and 13 is more like third and three for this team. They need the 27 yard line. Mahomes blitz his scent, stands in, and throws Hill. Well, that's Kelsey, I should say. Only looking for the X factor, but it's first down. It's easy when you look for the X if you try to differentiate between Hill and Kelsey. As Baltimore will challenge the ruling on the field. It said it was a completed catch. So we'll go through this. Did Kelsey get the feet down? Yeah, ooh, it looks closer here. 
And no, it, he did get his first. Well, it depends on if you rule as he had the ball when that right foot was down at first and left foot was the second foot. We'll see here, Travis Kelsey looking up, and he's completing his case. And not enough to overturn Baltimore's charge of timeout. And Baltimore can't get up off the field. That was a punt there, if that challenge was won. First and from the 26, quick pass hit, uh, Kelsey. And they won't have to overturn that. Second down and seven. Blitz look by Baltimore. And they do blitz. And Mahomes throws Robinson. First down and goal. They're all the way at the six. The first and goal. Kansas City. Hill in the slot at the bottom of the screen. Mahomes protected. We're gonna go to Hill. Can he reach over? He was hit, but he can't reach. It's second down and goal at the one. Online personnel now. Daryl Williams, the running back. Fake it to him. Mahomes. Blit man in his face. Hill Kelsey can't get in. It's third down and goal. As we have reached the fourth quarter. Kansas City with four straight touchdown drives. Can they move the ball one yard and make it five? They're up big here in the fourth quarter in Baltimore. So Kansas City has the ball again. Can they get one yard? They're going into the wind now. Not that it matters, but they're down and goal. Helen Kelsey at the top of the screen. They hand it. Edwards Elair. He loses four, and they're going to have to definitely kick a field goal now. They're going to run it. Maybe run a play on fourth and goal. Now they can't. Now that they're five yards away, Bucker makes a five straight scoring drives. It's 31 17. You know, it may be 31-17, but it is only 14 points. Baltimore can easily come back from this if they try. It is Duvernay down to the 23-yard lines, and Baltimore takes back over. So can Lamar Jackson put on an MVP drive? That he'll throw. He's protected. Gonna uncork it deep for Brown, who's got separation, but it's too short and incomplete. Oh, Lamar Jackson would like that one back. He had a touchdown. Now second down and 10. Jackson, quick throw, it's intercepted. Picks off by Fenton. Intended for Duvernay, and the Chiefs are back in scoring range. Man, you'd like to have that one back. Let's see what happened. He tried to get it to Duvernay, and wow, Fenton just had it. Duvernay couldn't hold on, and out comes the Chiefs. What a sequence from Lamar Jackson. Just a little bit under thrown for Brown. Of course, that was a really long throw. Over 50 yards. Now an interception that wasn't his fault. As Hill goes in motion. The fake to him. Mahomes will throw. Steps up. Throws it wide open. Kelsey. Touchdown. It's easy. The Chiefs are pouring it on. It's now a three-score game. It's going to be a 21-point lead after this. And how about that? No replay here. Only the celebration. So Harrison Bucker to make it 38-17 with 9.03 to play in the game. One play, 27 yards, five seconds, and Kansas City with two one-play touchdowns today. That makes it six straight scoring drives, by the way, for those of you keeping track. Devin Duvernay from the five. And won't get it to the 20. I'll actually give it right at the 20. So can Jackson get an MVP drive once again? <laughs> 21 significantly harder, however, as Jackson will throw. And J.K. Dobbins down to the 41-yard line, and they needed that. Jackson's only at 150 yards passing. Mahomes is almost, might crack 400 when it's all said and done. As Jackson will throw. Steps up and throws. Nick Boyle. And first, I uh, got about seven. It was a good... A good play on first down. So second and four. It's from nearing midfield. Jackson, quick pass. Devin Duvernay breaks one. Into the 40-yard line, and the Ravens are on the move. Of course, they need touchdowns now. They can't settle for field goals. First and 10 from the 40. Jackson, 
Gonna throw it, dropped. Marquis Brown couldn't hold on again, and another incompletion from Lar Jackson. He's had a really good game. I mean, well, the incompletions are really his fault, except for that drop by Brown deep. As Jackson underneath, it's caught by Duvernay again. His second street uh, catch for a first down. Now they're approaching the red zone. So from the 26, Jackson will throw. Stands in, nearly picked off. That was an accurate pass, a rare one from Jackson. Second and 10. From the 26, Lamar alone in the backfield. He'll throw. Protected over the middle. It's Duvernay. Duvernay loses the ball. Picked up by Kansas City. An unbelievable turnover. Willie Gay forced it, and Duvernay will now two turnovers when he was um, intended receiver. Willie Gay leaves the lumber there, and the Chiefs recover. Not big, and now they can run the ball and try to kill some clock. So from the 21, that's where the drive begins. 6.14 to play. I'll run it by, with Edwards E. Lair. And nowhere to go. The 10 rushes for 10 yards. Not really the ideal rushing stat line for fantasy owners. Second and nine. Edwards E. Lair again. This time a positive gain. It's a gain of five. That leaves him with a third down and four. They need the 30-yard line to convert. They give it. Edwards E. Lair has space. First down. And that's a gain of eight. And the Chiefs keep the drive alive. And you have to think that that drive, that um, first down was really important. Killing the clock, they're almost at four minutes. As Edwards E. Lair, a lot of space. And to the 46-yard line. And Baltimore has an injury as Justin Houston. And to the sideline, he'll go. Our second injury of the game. Frank Clark did, Clark did return as we see Houston on the sideline there. He'll probably go back in the game. Although at this point, it's a lost cause. First down and 10 from an offset eye backfield. They hand it off to Darrell Williams and a couple. A gain of two. That's his first handoff of the game to Darrell Williams. Under four to play officially. And a second and eight. Edwards Elair had nowhere to go. Maybe a yard and we'll bring up third and seven. Let's see if they'll throw for it. They need the 44 Baltimore to convert. And taking the play clock all the way down. Mahomes will throw for it. Unblocked defender. Mahomes going deep. Hartman has separation. Touchdown. Oh, how about that? <laughs> oh, Kansas City up 38-17. How about a deep 51-yard touchdown to McCole Harden's second 50-yard close touchdown of the game. To put this game away, they'll lead by 28 when it's all said and done. And Bucker will make it seven straight scoring drives to end this game. As seven plays, 80 yards, through 26 off the clock. Mahomes is electric as always. And now <laughs> this is a Kansas City game if I've ever seen one. Yeah, there's the kick by Bucker and Duvernay from the five. And it's to the 20-yard line. Let's see if Baltimore can recover. Two straight turnovers, an interception and a fumble, both intended for Devin Duvernay. As Jackson will start alone in the backfield from the 20. He'll throw. Probably throw for the rest of the game. Marquise Brown. He's got five or six, and Jackson's at 200 yards. Approaching the two-minute warning. The screen pass to J.K. Dobbins. Breaks off one leveled by Gay, and he's got a first down. As we've reached the two-minute warning. Kansas City up big. Looking to hold on, make it 4-0 against Lamar Jackson's Ravens. So from the 30-yard line, Jackson in the pistol. He'll throw. And underneath, Dobbins off his leg, it looked like. It was incomplete. There were three combined incompletions at the halftime for both these teams. Jackson will throw. Steps up. Three-man rush underneath. J.K. Dobbins, nowhere to go. So third down and eight. They need the 40-yard line to convert. Keep the drive alive. We'll see if they go for it on fourth down big. Jackson stands in. Misses Watkins. So now leaves him with fourth down and eight. 
So we keep the game going. I don't know if you want that <laughs> at this point. Jackson will throw. Gonna stand in and going deep for Andrews. Knocked down. Kansas City turns it over again. Three straight turnovers and, and that will probably do it as it looked like it was Tyron Matthew on the pass breakup. And there it was. It was a good throw by Jackson and Mark Andrews. If he's going to be the fourth best tight end in the game, he's going to have to make that. So Kansas City, you know, three straight rushing plays away from ending this game. It's in motion gray. We'll give it to Edwards Elair and Calais Campbell makes that game nothing. There's actually a loss of one. You see Calais Campbell so playing hard despite the score. Taking the play clock all the way down, Edwards Elair. Nowhere to go. We're getting a three. And they will throw it on this third down and seven. Guess to try and pour it on. Let's see what Mahomes does. Quick pass to Edwards Elair dropped. So they will kick a field goal. This will make it eight straight scoring drives. And 48-17 should Bucker make this 46-yard field goal. And he does. And that will do it for today's game. Not exactly the score I intended to end this game, but the Kansas City Chiefs win it 48-17 in one of the high-scoring CPU games I've ever seen. I hope you guys enjoyed this CPU, CPU gameplay here on the channel, Madden 22. If you did, leave a like and comment in the future. Instead of these 42-minute um, long episodes of the full game, we're just going to be doing the highlights. I'm going to be recording the full thing and uploading it unlisted. You'll be able to see this if you'd like. As you see the battle of the QBs. Patrick Mahomes, a perfect passer rating, no doubt. Just unbelievable. And Jackson played really well. The stats won't show it. As Baltimore goes in 0-4 against Patrick Mahomes' Chiefs. Hope you guys enjoyed, and see you next time.